Why is Canada so underpopulated? If you've ever been to Canada or you now reside there, you may already be aware of how simple it is to locate a back road devoid of people. You may also be aware of the endless miles of farmland and woodland that exist between towns. It's a really calm place, and while our major towns are bustling with activity, commerce, and people, they are dwarfed by how much of our nation is genuinely deserted. In this video, we will discuss the factors that have made it one of the world's lowest population densities in the past and continue to do so. Number 1. National Parks Canada's natural beauty has been preserved because of the government's attempts to protect it by setting up national parks. While many people think of national parks as just entertaining tourist destinations and locations to shop for trinkets, in reality, they were established to keep the population under control and prevent the construction of railways, towns, and industries in their natural habitat. Number 2. The Climate Canada may not be for you if you don't enjoy the cold. The fact that winters may be very cold below minus 50 degrees Celsius could be reason enough for many people not to visit. We are well known for our winter sports like hockey since the winter is our longest season. Number 3. Forested Land That Is Unlivable it is hardly surprising that Canada as a nation appreciates its natural resources. Around 10% of the total of the world's land is wooded, with Canada making up 42% of the total. Because forestry is still one of Canada's greatest industries, efforts are made to maintain the area's protection. Even when portions of a forest are chopped down, such portions remain crown property, and they are free to recover without interference from any other enterprises. Number 4. Immigrating to Canada and Obtaining a Visa You don't hear much about illegal immigration to Canada, do you? This is not to suggest that individuals never try it, it does happen, but it happens more often when someone goes through the judicial system and then just disappears, which makes them extremely simple to find. With the Pacific and Atlantic on all sides and the United States below, that typically draws immigrants rather than the other way around, as Canada has two natural border fences. Number 5. A Lack of Attractions for Tourists Outside of Major Cities Since tourism is a significant part of our economy, most of Canada's major cities are situated close to or around these tourist sites. Toronto has Niagara Falls and the CN Tower. Banff is surrounded by steep mountains and picturesque lakes. Whistler is close by in Vancouver. And Edmonton is home to the renowned West Edmonton Mall. Number 6. Living Expenses the drawback to residing in big urban centers such as Vancouver or Toronto is that these areas also often have the highest cost of living. Toronto's market rent is higher than the national average. Because it requires more energy to heat your home during the very long winters, the weather also has a tendency to raise living expenses. Number 7. Driving Let's assume we add erratic weather to the mix of the Rockies' jagged curving roadways and, just for kicks, let's add an inordinate quantity of animals. Elk, deer, and moose are among the larger species that you may be used to, in addition to smaller animals like lizards, gophers, or other generally harmless critters depending on where you are from. Number 8. The Territories the anticipated population of the 1,144,000 square kilometer or 442,000 miles Northwest Territories in 2019 was 44,895. With a population density of 0.039 individuals per kilometer, this territory has the highest population density while being the second smallest in size. Conclusion Canada is one of the richest countries in the world, but its population has always remained low. The causes for that have been discussed in detail, and it all boils down to socioeconomic or natural aspects. On the other hand, this makes it a very attractive place for people who want to live in a peaceful, calm place without much human activity. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, and turn on the notification bell.